What were your expectations leaving the Philippines? Actually, I didn't expect much. Uh, in fact, I have no intention of leaving the Philippines. Why not? My youngest brother and myself were the last ones to leave the Philippines. Everybody has gone up here. Mm -hmm. And for myself, I didn't want to leave the Philippines. Oh. In fact, I told my college sweetheart that I'd rather stay with you, you know. Anyway, we're happy here together. Mm -hmm. So I, uh, I wasn't expecting much here in America. It wasn't something you were going towards? No, not really. Not, mm -hmm, not me. Uh, I'm the kind of person that I'm happy with where I am, mm -hmm. with what I have. And in the Philippines, we were, we were not poor, uh -huh. but we were not rich either. No. But we made it, you know, okay. So I was happy with that. Upon leaving, all your siblings were here already? Yeah, they were all here. So your parents' reaction towards you coming here with them? What was the reaction? Well, they were glad because, you know, we were a very close family mm -hmm. and mom and dad always were looking after us. When we got separated, we were like, uh, well, we didn't know what, you know, exactly what was going to happen, what, you know, what we were to do. So mom and dad were kind of worried with us staying in the Philippines while they were here. And how old were you when you left the Philippines? It's about, I was about 20, just before the, you know, the petition expired, I think it expires when you're 21. Oh, yeah. So that's the time when I came over. What were your motives leaving the Philippines? Basically, it was because mom and dad wanted it. Oh, okay. They were saying, just try the life here. Mm -hmm. See yeah. how it is for you. And so we tried it for, yeah, that's about what happened. And who petitioned you? Uh, mom. And your mom? Actually, what happened was my sister came over as a professional. Uh -huh. uh, then she petitioned my mom uh -huh. and my dad, and my mom and dad then petitioned all of the rest of us. All of you guys. Uh -huh. So your sister is the first one here. In the yeah, United she was uh, the two of their. I have two sisters. They were the first one to come over. Professional. As professional. Oh. Eventually, they became immigrants and eventually became citizens. Citizens. Did you leave by yourself in the Philippines? No. When our papers were done, my mom, mom came over to fetch my brother and myself. Ah, oh, so there's three of you going. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you feel any sadness towards leaving the Philippines? Of course, yeah. <laughs> and my college sweetheart was there, mm -hmm. and you know, for her it was devastating, probably. It was something like that, but but she was hopeful oh. that you know maybe life in America is better. Yeah. That's why eventually we will make it better in America. That's what she was thinking. And it was your first time to travel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. It was my first time to travel. In fact, in the airplane, when they were serving food, mm -hmm. I didn't want to take any food. I didn't want to spend money. <laughs> I didn't know it was free. <laughs> That's true. And so, when my mom said, "No, you get the food. It's free." So I took the food. <laughs>